So I had to wait for the right movement. And once I saw the movement that it made, I was already, I, I was instantly in profit, right? It wasn't even that much drawdown this time around. I was instantly in profit. And let me show you how. What's good, guys? I'm Jay Wayne. You know, represent Team Take Profits, um, part of IML, iMarkets Live. Um, just, I'm expecting this week to be a great week in the market. I've been learning so much. I, uh, I mean, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you, right? I'm a beginner, right? I've been trading for five months and I've learned so much, right? I lost money, I made money, lost money, made money. But now it's getting to the point where I'm gradually, constantly making money, right? And I keep learning, right? So I wanted to, to show you uh, the things that I'm focused on this week. You know, we went through Bollinger Bands. Um, I showed you guys Fibonacci, support and resistance, right? But I'm trying to focus on pivots, right? Pivot points. Uh, combined with the moving averages and support and resistance. So we're trying to learn one thing. We're trying to learn candlestick patterns. We're trying to learn all these different things. And then we're trying to combine it together. You know what I mean? And make some serious money. So if we look on the uh, chart here, you see all these crazy lines you're like man jay what is this like i can't even see the candles right it's crazy it's messy but but understand uh there's a structure within this chaos right you see these orange lines it's just showing you support right support one support two i took two days of studying the pivots and now i'm trying to implement uh just so far you know we're in profit already just off of the pivots guys I mean, trading in this Forex market, right? It's easy if you be patient, right? It took me, it took me about two hours, three hours. I had to wait for the right movement. And once I saw the movement that it made, I was already, I, I was instantly in profit, right? It wasn't even that much drawdown this time around. I was instantly in profit. And let me show you how. Guys, it was in an uptrend. Right here, as you can see, I'm gonna I'm mark the chart as I go. It was in an uptrend here, right? We all understand that, it's simple, right? Uptrend, then it pulled back, right? And then it went on another uptrend, but this time, the uptrend this time, it didn't have as much momentum, did it? So it ran out of steam. And so then I started to pay close attention, right? And I saw that this flag was the move I was going to uh, jump in on. So it started to form this pullback, this flag. And as you can see, I have a trend. And I have it uh, kind of boxed in in a certain zone area. I waited till it got at the top of the movement. And I got in for a sell on a one hour chart. Now here's where here's where the pivot points come in at because you don't know when to get out, right? So you look at the previous three days, you look at the pivot points, and you see support here. You see a support level here. But we can't just focus on just the technicals of it. We have to use logic. We have to use logic. So if the if the pivot point shows that it's here. And the support level is here. But where did price in the past stop at? Did it make it all the way to that support level? Or did it stop before? So you can't just go off of these indicators. You have to use logic. Right? Keep it simple. And so I noticed that price continues to drop down here. And then it goes back up. And then, and then it gets to this level. And then it buys again then it's buyers in the market right so i drew 
excuse me, so I drew my support line. I drew my line here. And that's where I plan on taking profit, right? And if I see that it wants to reverse on my stochastic, then I get out earlier. You know, use logic. Let the market come to you and then we react to the market as we go. One thing for sure that we know is that it's going to go to the bottom of our line here, our uh, trend line. Because it always goes to the top, to the bottom, right? That's one thing for sure. But will it pass it? We have to wait and find out. You have to be patient. And if you can look on my stochastic, one thing that I uh, value the most. My stochastic, it hasn't turned to the upside yet. Right? It's still pointing downward. So that's one way I know to stay in my trade. See, I don't just use just, I don't just focus on one thing as I trade. It's multiple different things of, con multiple levels of confirmation I use, right? So the main thing is patient or not. Patient or not. You patient or you're not, right? And the ones that like to jump into the trade, jump into the market without uh, going through the levels of confirmation, they give us the money, right? They're giving us the money. But over here, we represent team take profits. We take profits. We don't give profits. We take profits from the market, right? You know, this is just a quick, simple version of, of what I'm looking at uh, for this week, the method that I'm using. Um, every month I'm learning a, a new strategy and I'm implementing that strategy, right? And I wanna vlog it and show you guys, um, you know, what I'm learning as I go because I'm five months in and I know it's a lot of people that is uh, brand new, haven't even started trading yet and you wanna know what the journey looks like. Well, I'm here for you and I'm trying to vlog as much as I can. So I appreciate if you can give this video a like, thumbs up. You know, if you're learning anything, if it's giving you any value, you know, subscribe to my page because this is what I do. This is my passion. Week after week, right? I'm going to bring you another great quality video. So we're going to wait and see uh, what this does. We can see that it's almost to the bottom trend line. And uh, we want to see did it hit. Uh, the bottom of the trend line and bounce up did it hit our support pivot right we want to wait and see so we have to be patient guys so here we are right and this is the moment where you either get greedy or you take your profit right and you use um you, you use logic right if you can look at the the chart i know it's a little messy let me get rid of some of these lines Cause we already went over these lines here and what it what it meant so look at this earlier i told you it has to come down to this uh trend line right we are we are past the trend line and now it has passed the pivot uh support and resistance right one every time in the market look every single time in the market when price got in this area in this zone what did it constantly keep doing it touched this zone and goes back up then it touched this zone and it goes back up so what's going to happen this time it is for some reason this this moment is is so special that it's going to keep dropping it could be or are you going to use logic and say you know what i should take my profit or take partial profit and continue seeing what it's going to do all right, so to be an example, I think I'm going to take partial profit. All right, but one thing, one thing though, one thing that when all else fails, one thing that I rely on is my stochastic. That is my baby. All right, look at it. If you can see on my stochastic right here, it's still going, it's still pointing downward, right? It hasn't showed, the green line hasn't showed any signs of of it uh, pointing up or turning back to the upside, right, for a buy. 
So that's the reason to still stay in there for me. And as you can see, this red candle is dropping. Let's see the profits that we are earning right now. So that's where we at right now. All right. So that's pretty good. I mean, we can stop there and be fine. You know, we don't have to get too greedy, right? But that's the thing. Could you be patient enough? Could you wait two, two or three hours to get into a trade to make sure that you get the right movement? Could you be patient or not? I'm going to drop that down to 0 0.50. And that leaves us with this. Right? Because we already secured profits. So that leaves us with that much. So, you know, that's to me, that's the smartest thing to do. Right? And now, now we can feel comfortable with continue writing a trade down to see, you know, where is it going to go next. See, I've only been trading for five months. And what I love the most, guys, is that it doesn't take long to make money. Right, because the company iMark is live, you know, fast starts you with all the educational videos that they have, you know, once you join the team, you know what I mean? Once you join, you know what I'm saying, the, the company, they, they, they have so many videos from basics, intermediate to advanced, it's crazy. So, you know, it, it just fast starts you. And then once you get the basics, right, and understand then you can just start learning so many different strategies right so many different things to learn out here that can help you and that you can combine within your confirmations and your checklists as you trade in all right so all this stuff may seem foreign and it's just a lot of bunch of candles going up and down but the company gives you the understanding the education so it can all make sense to you. And then you have guys like me that's a part of the team and you have team take profits and people that within your city that can help you uh, because you can lock arms. You have to lock arms, right? You have to be a part of a team, right? And that's what iMarkers Live do for you. You know, so many people, I mean, YouTube it, Google it. So many people have so many good things to say about it because of the structure of the company, right? So, if you guys have any questions, always feel free to uh, email me. My email is below, right? And, um, and then, you know, follow me on social media. You know, you can see my tags here in the corner. Follow me on social media. I would love to connect with each and every one of you guys. Uh, don't forget to like this video, right? Comment and subscribe. And let's make this money, baby. Peace.